Dingin. there's drugs involved here and i know that it's a sweeping statement for me to say this but i know meth is prevalent in the oil fields well do you recognize anything from the what's case there yeah i did see if you can notice the things that those people were saying about the drug okay let's see what you can pick up bad idea First of all, Netflix make me a, a partner so I get the, the film a week early. So I get the, the film a week early. Despite what they say, that he hasn't got it, I had it all right. And I worked it all out a week before. And I give 10 timestamps to prove I had it. 10 timestamps, 10 timestamps. 10 timestamps. Okay, so that proves we've got it. I hope to you. That's a screenshot from it we have seen it and there's another one another screenshot from the documentary that no one obviously no one's seen it yet because it's not aired yet so how come i've got it some people call it nonsense some call it lies but because it appears in many different forms i will call it bullshit <laughs> Go after Nancy Grace, because she has the same opinion as me. The exact same opinion as me. Look at me. You don't put words in my mouth. This is massive for us. Because to get someone like this to support us is unbelievable. But I'll tell you what I know. I'll be honest with you. I, I've been told by very credible sources that there was four people there that night. I mean, I can tell you that as if it's like, I can't say it's gospel. But it's the nearest thing I can get to telling you the truth. <laughs> well, Nancy's saying it now. Nancy's saying it now. Nancy's saying it now. She lied. In my opinion, and Nancy Grace's opinion. I'm trying to help her. I'm trying to help her. What more can I do to help the woman? She Googled Shanann a year before the murder. Don't you see that?
she called in to the tip line and said, hey, I'm the other woman, essentially. And after investigating, we were confident that she had no role to play in this tragic event. Radio Amor. A $25 gift. I've been there.